our Power BI project started quite a long time ago, I guess. We had demonstrations of a few different systems, so Power BI, ClickView and others, and we thought Power BI looked the best. And obviously within the NHS, it seems to be the, the way people are going. And um, Cloud2 were the partner that um, presented the product then, and I'm impressed with it. And we, in partnership with, with another trust, went with Cloud2 to give us a Kickstarter and give us a good breadth of knowledge from the start so that we have one dashboard that was complete and ready and, you know, as good as it could be. But then we also had the skills to roll out further and get other dashboards going, which is really important. It's worked really well and the team now have a lot of confidence from the training afterwards as well to go on to the next areas. We chose ED with many trusts. It's the most important area of the hospital in many ways. It would be well used and something that people are always trying to improve on, have a lot of operational input within. We also thought it was a pretty discreet area, so it didn't rely on data from lots of different areas of the hospital, which the first place we went to, that was important to us. And so in terms of how the project ran, we engaged with operational people. We've come from a system we have already, so we have some subjects in the trust, we already have a lot of reporting. And it was important that what we did was to have something that wasn't just a replication of what we do already, but at the same time covered a lot of the requirements of what we do at the moment. So we worked with operational people to work out what they wanted, but we needed to guide them quite a bit in terms of what we thought was required. And Cloud2 were really good at that process as the requirements changed and grew, I suppose. They were really flexible and produced something that in the end answered most, if not all, of what we wanted. In terms of the flexibility of what we signed up to was one thing. What we ended up with was probably quite a lot more than what we were expecting. And Cloud2 were, were appreciative that we needed more than what we initially started with. That, that flexibility and ability to produce something that covered such a wide area was really helpful to us and meant that it wasn't just a narrow report. It was something that would be useful to quite a lot of people with an ED. And I think going through the process, um, James is great in terms of coming back to us with showing us stuff along the way. And we were able to look at it and make tweaks here and there and say you know, the consistency across the pages, the report and the way things work, make it when you use it, it's quite intuitive. If we were to do it first time round ourselves, we just spent a lot of time kind of going backwards and forwards and trying to work out the best way of getting people to interact with the report. Whereas with Cloud 2's experience, you knew how to do that already. It works. I think that responsiveness, the end product works. And having worked with Cloud 2 already, you can't, we kind of know what we're going to get. The next thing we do, it would kind of fit within what we've already got, which is, you know, a really great start. So rather than have somebody else come in and, you know, you don't quite know what you're going to get and you don't quite know how it's going to look and is it going to look similar to what, what we've already gone through with Cloud 2, I think it's important for consistency that it, that it does work the same way and we know how it's going to work. And, you know, people are very happy with what we've got. So I don't know why he's really changed.